Okay, so this is a video about the dis the uh, biodegradable uh, utensils that we got at the uh, Christmas party. Here's a spoon, an unadulterated spoon. Here is utensils put in water on the day of the Christmas party, which was sometime in late December. Here are some spoons that were put in ginger ale on January the 6th. Some spoons that was put put in some compost on the same day, January the 6th, and uh, a spoon that was put in some bio-friendly drain cleaner on January the 19th. Uh, it is currently March the 29th, uh, so it's on the order of uh, three months after we originally started this. Uh, so I'll, we'll open each one and we'll uh, look at a little bit at uh, whether or not the properties have changed any. Okay, I'm turning this off for a second and uh, then we'll uh, start in or maybe I'll just leave this running. Okay, so this water, I'm, I'm trying to take the ones out of the water, it feels a little bit slimy actually in the, the the knives, it's, I don't have a spoon here, but you can see uh, ooh, it's really kind of slippery uh, and it's quite pliable. And uh, the water has sort of a, a uh, corn smell to it. Uh, and you can see here, maybe, let me try and get this off in the distance a little bit. You can see that the uh, knife seems to be much more pliable. Is that in view? Yeah. So I can very easily bend the knife. It's much more pliable than the spoon is. Okay, so that's that's the one that was in the water. Uh, let's take a look at the one that was in the ginger ale. I think this was a suggestion from, from Ethan. So uh, again, it's it's kind of got a very slippery uh, slimy kind of feel to it. It's very tactile and actually I don't know if you can see that but it's it's quite pliable. I'll bring this out onto the paper and maybe kind of applying the same amount of pressure to each one you can see that the, the one that's been in the ginger ale is is quite a bit more pliable than the other one and, and even has a kind of distorted uh, look to it. Uh, Let's see, the same time frame as that was the compost. Uh, this is just some of my, uh, it's actually kind of disgusting in here. Uh, this is just some compost that I was, uh, came out of my uh, compost heaps. And some, I can see some coffee grounds in there. And you can certainly see that uh, the color has changed. And again, it's, uh, it's pretty pliable in comparison to the unused one and uh, against the one that was in the ginger ale. Uh, I don't know, I would have to say that perhaps the one that was in the ginger ale is slightly more pliable than the one that was in the compost. Uh, okay, we have one last one to take a look at and that's this uh, bio drain cleaner stuff. This is uh, stuff that's supposed to put a uh, good bacteria in your drains in the hopes that it will help make some of the, uh, some of the, it will eat some of the uh, stuff that clogs up your drains. This has been, uh, this started about two weeks after the stuff that was in the ginger ale and the compost and uh, I don't know, it's still more pliable than the original. Uh, but uh, I have to say that in comparison to the ginger ale, it, it's very different now. I guess that's two weeks out of 12, so it's, uh, it's about 16% shorter in terms of how long it's been in anything, but somehow that, that seems to be more than 16% pliability to me. Uh, so after three months, I guess there is some degradation of the material. Uh, but it doesn't look to me like it's really biodegraded yet. 
So we'll uh, seal these back up again, and uh, maybe in another three months we'll uh, take another look and see how we've done.